Hey guys, welcome back and today I will help you all to make your old MacBook run faster. It applies with both Air as well as Pro. So I'm not a professional software guy that can fix it, but what I can tell you is what I have tried in my MacBook and which has done wonders for me. So just in case if you're wondering which laptop I have used, well, I've been using MacBook Air and it's late 2015 model which means I bought this back like 5 years ago but still I edit my YouTube videos here. So I'm gonna show you all how I'm doing this in this old machine. First thing first I want you to do is clear your desktop. It's very easy to store everything there but when you ever restart your MacBook it loads up right? If it is taking longer than expected then clean your desktop. Just arrange folders and from my advice buy an hard disk and put everything related to your work there and then try to boot up your Mac. It might open 1% faster. Another thing that you can try is going to system preferences and then clicking on users and then you will find this column by the name of login items. Well, you got me right. Whatever you feel that is not necessary, get rid of it. Like this can be the big reason for your slow Mac, especially when you start it. So try doing this first two things and see if you feel any difference. Second thing that I can or I want you all to do is just please go and download this free app which is linked below you can try it all and it's not sponsored by any means so the name of the app is max fan control and i use this app the most in the list and it has made my mac like way faster than before especially during video editing well you must have experienced this when your mac fan runs too fast that you feel devastated and you feel it might blow off well then this app comes in your way basically it lets you control the fan you can access this from the top as you can see it will show your current fan level in default it will be in set to automatic but when you do intense work like editing and all just set it to full blast now it will help you to work faster and silently so yeah there you go very dope and cool right try it for yourself and as you can see the interface is very easy to you can see the fluctuation of the fan speed another thing that i know gonna sound very stupid is all please why don't you guys clear your storage i mean Please clear it. I mean, please check your recycle bin right now. Why it's not empty. I know that. So do that first. Why it should be, right? You have to understand one thing that these small things will not change or make your laptop 10 times faster. But this is the process. Trust me. Please don't keep this movies, files, apps that you don't use. And I'm guessing you might know this also. After you close the app, the app is not permanently closed. It is still running in the background and taking all the space and en energy. So please double click on that app and you will see this quit option just quit it so every time you're done with that app just quit it and if not you can also go for force quit if that's necessary on number five you just have to press command plus shift plus g and write this i will put this somewhere you can pause this video and take a screenshot of it and also i will put this in description so these are all cache files i mean memories which which means they are of no use these things have been in your laptop from five years like the day when you bought it so yeah, it has been for so long and as you can see right now i have humongous amounts of files in my laptop so i just had to delete them all next up you can try this is go on finder and write activity monitor and boom you will see everything like which app or file is taking most out of your cpu and then you can close it and then in the side you can actually see other columns like memory like which is the RAM, it will show you out of 8 GB how much RAM is in use right now. I mean, you get my point, like which app or website is taking the most right now. As you can see in my column of CPU, these top three things are taking most of the place. So you can cut them off. Last thing you can do is download CC Cleaner. I'm not saying you to download the paid version. Free version is enough for us right now. Just download and install the app open it from your system and as soon as you will do it you will see this page where you can delete your safari chrome and system files be very specific while choosing this i took a lot of time to select my preference and i would suggest you all to do the same and just go through this and yeah we are done and also please just don't select this user download file because whatever you are downloaded in your system that might go away so take care of that so that's why i'm saying saying take your time and choose your preference and yeah we are done so this was my list of how to make your old MacBook run faster. If you like it by any means, do let me know. And also do try the steps and let me know how it was. And I'm sure your MacBook will not fly high up in the sky, but for sure it will perform better than before. And that's what we need to stretch our machines. 
With that being said, I will see you all in the next video and subscribe for more. And again, I'm AJ and I'm signing off. Bye-bye.